What's up, North County? I'm your host, Randy Doty, and today we got on the show Brandon Steyer with National Motor Fest. Welcome to the show. Thank you for having me. Appreciate yeah, it. Yeah, so what do we got going on? I hear it's a really awesome event. Yeah, uh, so it's September 3rd um, at the Madonna Inn in San Luis. Um, you know, we started this in 2019. COVID had other plans for us to continue, of course, so we've had a, you know, a two-year gap and finally able to actually put it together. So um, the entire event benefits um, Along Comes Hope, and they're here locally based in uh, San Luis Obispo. Uh, they help children battling cancer, so that's kind of our kind of our main focus with this event is to, uh, to benefit them the best we can. Um, so we've teamed up with uh, Barrel House. They're our presenting sponsor, actually. Oh, nice. Um, so we're, we're expecting around uh, close to roughly probably 7,000 people this, this, this Saturday. No kidding. Uh, coming up, yeah. Um, last time we had about 5,000, so um, wow. yeah, kind of did some, um, you know, some good reaching out and stuff. But uh, we call it National Motor Fest because we, we didn't want to just have a normal car show, right? Um, and when I say normal, we didn't want it to be just classics or just imports or just off-road. We wanted it all. So it's, it's basically our motto is for the love of all motors. So, um, you know, we've got uh, two helicopters landing. Uh, we have H-70 from CHP. We have Mercy uh, Air 34s landing as well, mid-event, right? So oh, really? um, pretty close. That'll give a chance for folks to get up real close to see this. Um, so I'll kind of start in one section. We have 107,000 square feet dedicated to just fire, military, um, and police. Um, so we have uh, over 50 agencies throughout the entire state coming. Um, we have every branch of the military, um, and they're all there showing off all their equipment. We got the SWAT team. I mean, we got it all. Wow, yeah, man, this lot, is a big event. Yeah, it's, it's big. Yeah, it's... Uh, I, I, don't, I don't like to go uh, go small anymore. I like to, you know, go big or go home kind of deal. So, sure. um, so then we have, uh, you know, our registered motors uh, section, um, and that's going to be everything from cars and trucks um, of every category. So you've got exotics, you've got classic exotics, you've got classics, you've got modern muscle, imports, you name it, it's there. Uh, we have currently scheduled, unless it gets windy in the morning, um, a hot air balloon as well. So that'll be there for you know, for kids to get up close to and, and kind of see, because most people don't get to see that. Um, wow. Yeah, it's, it's, it's going to be pretty cool. We've got RVs there. Um, we've got some boats, motorcycles. I mean, you name it. Um, and then we even have uh, lots of events happening within the day, right? So um, we've got a uh, exhaust competition. Actually, no, uh, what? A, a, an exhaust competition. So okay. um, it's going to be, you know, cars are going to get to battle who has the loudest exhaust there okay. and stuff. Yeah, it'll be pretty cool. Um, but even further, we're going to wake up San Luis uh, at about 930, where every single car there, including all the fire trucks and everything, is just going to sound off. Just right? make some noise. We're going to make some noise. So... Uh, I'm sure I'm sure people will hear that for sure because we've got some race cars there. Um, it's it's gonna be pretty cool. But you right know, back on. back to the events, uh, we do have um, some canine demonstrations. So uh, you know, bite demonstrations, the uh, sniffing out a car to try and find you know drugs or something, whatever they would find in there from police canines. Um, mm. We're smashing cars, uh, you know, with with sledgehammers and stuff to raise money for uh, you know for the charity. Um, there's RC car racing, sumo R RC car racing, where they're on top of a table and push each other off. So kids will get to rent that out. And we got a gaming trailer, bounce houses, 12 food trucks, uh, plenty, wow. plenty of beer. Yeah, it's, uh, it's you got it's me on cool. that one. Yeah, there you go. Right. So yeah, yeah. I get that, the that's the only reason I'm showing up. <laughs> Otherwise, I was just going to stay home. But, yeah. <laughs> wow. Yeah. So this started in 2019. 2019 is Cali Auto Fest, actually. Um, and so we got to kind of reevaluate after that year. Um, we wanted to call it National Motor Fest because we do have goals of taking this. Um, I think our next state is going to be in Texas. Um, it'll be a few years just so we work through all the kinks and stuff and, um, you know, kind of make this work out. But, I mean, this is home, man. This is where it's always going to start and always going to be. So every year, and you know, to find a, find a space that's large enough, we had to go to, you know, San Luis and go to the Madonna Inn, which is, you know, right off the freeway and great exposure. So. Right. So National Motor Fest, that's mm -hmm. something that you started. Correct. In yeah, your so I, a co-founder. Yeah. So right. Tyler Henry um, also is a, a business partner of mine. Um, we've got Jake Smith. Um, he's, he's our COO. He's in charge of operations. Um, we've got Vince, we've got Sean. Yeah, we've, we've got, we've built a, built a pretty cool team that's, uh, 
able to help us get out there to uh, you know expose and get some more cars and really cool cars every year. And so this is a nonprofit. Um, so we we cur- we are actual for profit, um, but we benefit the uh, the actual charity um, mainly from this. I mean, we put this entire show on. It costs almost sixty grand. Um, and so that's where all of our sponsors come in to help do that. Um, they wow. also bring in lots of, uh, you know, lots of raffle prizes for, uh, you know, for the charity day mm-hmm. of and stuff. So that raises a lot for them. So, um, you know, la- I think last time we raised, I want to say almost 7,000. I-, I couldn't, I couldn't tell you exactly from 2019 because it was such a blur. Right. Um, but we're, we're hoping to hopefully triple that this year for them and then continue on. So, so 19, <clears throat> excuse me, 19, 20. Mm-hmm. Uh, yeah. So in 2020, we had it planned. We had the whole event. And we had everything scheduled and then COVID again. shut us down. Uh, 2021 was, was kind of the same deal. Uh, we weren't quite sure what we were going to do. It was kind of last minute. And then even in 2022, in the beginning of the year, uh, you know, for these, you, you start marketing out, you know, sure. a year in advance and start talking with the community and stuff. And, uh, we really only had about six months when we started building it back up again to to make it work, and then we were at about three months when we were like, "All right, we're doing it." So, is there a cost for a spectator to come and check it's it out? It's free for spectators, free parking at the event on the meadows. Uh, just buy a beer. That's, and so that's it's not else. like necessarily a car show. It's just basically observing, checking out these cool yeah. cars. Well, yeah, so the cars that are there, um, they register, there's a registration fee for them. Okay. Um, but for spectators, anybody from the public that could come in, it's all free to them. Hmm. Yeah. So, so when somebody comes in there, it starts, what time does it start on Nine Saturday? o'clock in the morning. Okay. Um, and it'll go until four. Until four o'clock. Yeah. And so all day events going on, scheduling. All day. Yeah. We've got, we've got all kinds of stuff, flex tests from off-road vehicles, you know, to see how high one of their wheels can get before the back one pops up. Uh, limbo competition with cars, see who has the lowest car to go underneath and stuff. Yeah, we, and I almost forgot, we do have flyovers. So we have the Warbirds Museum is doing some flyovers and stuff as well. So Super cool. Yeah, I'll uh, I'll definitely share some some event calendars with you so you can see you for know, sure. all those times. So, awesome. Yeah. Right on, Brandon. Hey, Thank thanks you. for coming on the show. Absolutely. Well, there you have it, guys. One, two, September 3rd in San Luis Obispo at Madonna Event Center. We'll see you there.